Hey guys, it's Scar. Today is the day that we get the nose done. Hmm. So I am about to get on a plane, go to Double Bay, which is where Dr. Zachariah's office is. And I think I'm just going to chill there until I have to go into surgery. Oh, what's it called? Into theatre. That's the one. In a car said that I could go under the LED light that they have there. So I might just relax and go under the healing light and just stress less. I haven't slept at all. I'm really nervous. Um, I've just packed everything that I need to pack. I'll show you what I've got in my carry-on bag. I've got my makeup, makeup wipes so I can take my makeup off, headphones, I'm going to take my computer, I'm just going some water now because you can't have any water after 10am. The nurse has said I've got a fast from 10am so I think I might go get a sugar free energy drink and off we go. So. I'll see you when I get to Sydney. I'll show you around Dr. Zachariah's room. So sorry about the last video I uploaded. I feel like I was rambling so much. But I just wanted to make sure that no one was offended and that people understood why I wanted a nose job. And that I'm not trying to harm this generation by putting it out there. I think I've talked about it enough. So yeah, I will see you guys soon. give you guys a quick tour here's the waiting room obviously very cute got a little makeup stand this is all brand new guys and where's the I love this mirror so we'll be putting your LED on in this room today okay perfect and um, what setting are we putting me on the um, red light I think we'll do the white light because it's really healing, anti-inflammatory, great for preventing bruising for surgery. Okay, perfect. Sex room. Where is he? He's just doing a patient at the moment. Okay. Comes right around. And we're done. It's pretty snazzy. Beautiful. Okay. Love it. So happy to get rid of these nostrils. So happy to get rid of these nostrils. Okay, so Inika has just put a sorry, I'm getting distracted. A mask <laughs> when am I ever not distracted? A mask on my face. And it feels really good already. Loving it. And then I'm going to put under the LED light, which is so exciting. I'm so excited to show you guys what my nose is going to look like. Goodbye, old nose. You will not be missed. Hey, guys. So I'm in the hospital now. I'm really, really nervous. <laughs> like really nervous. I just don't feel like getting 
a needle stuck in my hand right now. So they're going to give me some Valium. So that will hopefully help relax me. But yeah, I'm just waiting for the anesthetist lady to come through and put that needle in me. Yes, hooray. Not really. I'm so nervous. I'm more nervous now than what I was getting my boobs on. Just because I know that there's risks that you take when getting surgery and I just hope that everything goes swimmingly well. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Wish me luck. Bye. Look who picked me up from the hospital. Hi. Belle, my favorite person. Hello. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's see my face. <laughs> this is what I look like. We are killing a lot. Oh, excuse me, when haven't we? <coughs> Maybe you have a nurse to look after you. Okay, we're going back to Bell's now. Uh, I'm in a little bit of pain. But yeah, everything went well, apparently. It's all a G thing. Very bronzed with the nips. Oh, just hard as fuck. Okay, bye. Hey, guys. So... Oh, my camera is so dirty. So it is oh, day one after surgery. This is what I currently look like. He just cries for no reason. She. she. Why does she cry? Because she wants attention. Is that why? Yeah. Oh, a bit like me then. Okay. Yeah, I feel ya. It's all good. When I first got home last night and took this off, <laughs> I started bawling my eyes out. Like, I don't know why. But it looks really weird. It looks like a little pig nose. Oh, I just hope it looks good. Obviously, I'm swollen right now, and you don't know what it's going to look like until you get your bandages off. But it's still scary because it just looks so different. I'm very blocked. My nose is very blocked and congested. Last night when I woke up, it was super painful because obviously he's brought my nostrils in. So I've got stitches through here and up here, which means I'm gonna have to really look after that and start putting scar cream on so that I don't have big ugly scars. I can't shower. I've been sleeping all day. My whole face is like so swollen. But yeah, it's so hard to see what it's gonna look like with all this. Oh my god, Sky! What? I forgot to tell you. What? Is it private? No. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go, that guys. Guy. Oh, hang on. Say bye. Okay, bye. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey, sexy. Hey. Hater, girl. <laughs> <laughs> so, it is day two. Oh, my God. And I'm in so much pain. Like, so much pain. My face has swell swollen up even more. So, it just gets worse. <sighs> So yeah, that's a little update for today. I've been sleeping all day. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this bruising. Yeah, so moral of the story is it's very painful. And I've swollen up okay. even more. It's so hard to eat. So I haven't had a lot of food. But Mel and I are just going to the shops now 
to get to cut it all. Cut it all. And yeah, that's what we're doing. Looks like a pig nose at the moment. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. This is the weather stat. Status. This is the weather update with it's Mel it. and Sky. Hey Bailey. Hey guys, day three of recovery. This is what I'm looking like. Whoa, my screen. It's just not having it. Yeah, so day three, I've been putting peas on my eyes, taking painkillers. I feel much better today, but my nose has not stopped bleeding. It's crazy. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow for day four of recovery. Hello, lovers. <laughs> I look so ugly. I'm so over looking at my face like this. It's just becoming a problem. But anyway, you've got to expect that when you get your face half ripped up. So this is day four of recovery and it is looking much better. Like, I don't think I look as scary as what I did in day two or three. I hope you guys aren't gonna get sick of me doing like an update every day. I basically just wanted to show you guys how it would progressively look. I freaked out a lot and I was thinking, oh my God, it's so big, my nose looks so big. Everything just looks so, not how it's going to look, obviously when you're not swollen and when you don't have bruises and yeah, when you don't look like a zombie, so. I just wanted to document it so people who decide to get their nose done know that it's normal for the swelling and the bruising to make everything look super abnormal. Even my face feels so fat and I think it's like just all swollen. Anyway, so yes, this is day four. We went to the beach today. <laughs> Literally, went to the beach looking like this in Sydney. Ay, so good. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to go to sleep tonight and just rest up. Pee my face with ice and I've been using this for the bruising. See, it's dripping now, again. Oh, <laughs> So I've just been doing this constantly. Oh my God. Um, another thing that I've been doing is spraying my nose, spraying my nose with this. It's just like saline salt spray. You're supposed to breathe it up your nose, but I can't do that because my nose is so blocked and then I've also been using this scar cream for the scars because as you can see they're all around here so yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow also I just wanted to quickly tell you guys that it's completely normal to get super constipated <laughs> from all like the painkillers that they give you and um, the anaesthetist. So I'm just going to have one of these. I've had one today already, but it didn't, ugh, it didn't do much. You really take your nose for granted. Like I've taken breathing for granted and like just being able to like blow my nose would be so good. But um, yeah, so it's normal to get constipation with surgery, with any surgery. Happened when I got my boobs done as well. Oh my God, I'm so fake. <laughs> Saline everywhere, you are like so fake. I can't get over it. Oh my God, what are you having done next? <laughs> Jokes. <laughs>
But seriously. I'll update you guys tomorrow if I end up going to the toilet or not. But I have not gone to the toilet since surgery, which was on Wednesday. It is now Sunday. <laughs> it's day six. Mel just got back from the gym. Hi. <laughs> I didn't go because you're lazy. No, let's be honest, who wants to work out girl. when they look like this? No one. No one. Bailey, do you? No. Bailey, look at the fam. Hey. <laughs> so, yes. Make it fam. This is day six and um, still a little bit of bruising, but the swelling has gone down dramatically, which is amazing. So... I'm feeling good today, not much yeah, pain. Good. Feeling amazing. amazing. I had another panic attack last night about my nose and like text my doctor's uh, wife like, like 10 times and I'm like, oh my god, is my nose gonna be pointy? But yes, I am okay today. I'm calm, I'm relaxed. Paid all my bills and was just basically a badass adult. And now we're going to go take Bailey for a walk. So I'll see you tomorrow. Guys, so it's day seven. And I kid you not, I am on the break. Is that a word? I'm so on edge and I feel like I'm about to have a mental breakdown. Like, I'm so anxious. I've got so much anxiety about my nose and what it's going to look like. Uh, I guess I just keep looking at it in the cast and it's really hard for me to gauge what it's going to actually look like. And yeah, just a day full of anxiety because tomorrow I get the splint out and Friday is when the cast comes off and I'm just really fucking nervous and I just need this to be good because I can't have a fucking botched nose and botched boobs. That would just be... I'd be like a walking life lesson for other women, which is not very good for me, maybe good for everyone else, but, oh god, like, it was to the, it was getting to the point where I was like shaking, like, couldn't breathe properly, that's how anxious I am, like, I don't even think I'll be able to look at my nose, I'm just going to have to look at other people's reactions to see if it's good or not. I swear to God, if this is not fucking perfect, I will not leave my house. First world problems. Seriously, fuck. I need to put my life into perspective. I need to put my life into perspective. This is not a big deal. Why are you worrying about it? It's going to be perfect. It's going to be amazing. Be positive. And we're good. Okay, see ya. Hey guys, just did Mel's makeup. Let's get a little snapshot of that, shall good. we? Good. Oh, I'm good, I'm oh good, I'm God. so good. Yeah, girl. <laughs> okay, and then there's, <laughs> then there's the ugly friend. Like, <laughs> hi, I'm just Tom Tavi. I'm just trying to just look half as good as her with the nose. Um, so this is day eight of surgery. This is what it's looking like. We're going to get my splint out, which I'm really nervous about. And you're going to have a gorgeous nose. And it's going to be fucking perfect. And if it's not, I'm going to kill someone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, last day of this on my face. Yay. Going to get this taken off. And I've never been more nervous in my life. So, this is what my scars look like they're not looking good at all hopefully that will heal okay I'll see you guys when this is off so this is my nose so swollen and I can't wait to tell you guys what 
has fully happened to me throughout this experience. I'm going to make a whole nother video where I can, when I can actually put makeup on and feel good about myself. This is the nose. <laughs> I, look like a, I look like a little piggy. But it is very, very swollen. That's it from the side. And it is so pointy. And I was freaking out about this bit. But apparently it's just swelling. So we'll see. Here's the other side. It looks more pointy than what my nose did before the surgery. So I'm like, oh, what the F? But it's swelling. So I have to wait for it to go down to see what it will look like. And then I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. And yes, I'm naked. Nothing wrong with a little bit of nudity. <laughs> Hey guys, well it's really bright so I'm going to stay back here. I'm going to go see my doctor because I'm a little bit freaked out by this nose right now. Like, I'm happy with it but <laughs> it's so long. So if that comes down like that, then I'll be happy. Um, hopefully it's just swelling. Obviously, it's probably just swelling. So, I'm not I'm not as anxious as what I was waiting for the cast to come off. But, let me tell you, this was the most traumatic experience of my life. So, yeah. Just make sure you know what you're in for. I rated Jai's covered. Okay, this is skirt is suede and it feels so nice anyway I don't know how to use the settings on my camera and it's too bright because I turned something up because last night was way too dark and now I just don't oh here yeah. one can we take that oh 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 there you go oh is that too dark Okay, I think that's on normal. Alright, perfect. He definitely got rid of that little end that I didn't like. I'm happy with it. I just want it to be a little bit smaller. Which it will be. Okay, I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. Concert. I'm so upset that I missed it. Congratulations, Kayla. You haven't even turned that one in the right way. <laughs> Gold and silver. Come on, let's get in the car. Okay. Hey guys, it's me. Even though it doesn't look like me, it is me. It's the next morning. Mum picked me up from the airport last night. I just had a makeup client just then. And now I'm going to go back to bed, tape my nose because it is so swollen, so swollen. But you know what? I'm actually really happy with it. Um, <laughs> except from the side, but I know that that's swelling here because he did most of the work in the tip. So I'm just massaging it and taping it every time I go to bed you have to tape it for eight hours a day to like keep it all in place and I've just been like frantically googling stuff about rhinoplasties which is what I should have done in the first place so I didn't freak out 
but when does Sky Wheatley ever do her research? Never. When did Sky Wheatley ever listen in school? Never. So I guess they're just my consequences. But yeah, it is very, very swollen, which is making it look huge. Huge. But as I can see it go down each day, it gives me hope. Because at first I hated it. But I really like it from the front. Just the sides are very swollen. So I'll keep you all updated. Hope this vlog was interesting. It would be, right? Because I look like a pig. Oh my gosh, what? No, I really love it from the front. Just a little bit smaller. I've had really bad insomnia. And I haven't been able to sleep very well. It's a super overcast day. So, I don't feel bad about going back to bed. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this vlog up. I just kind of wanted you guys to see the healing process. I will do a... I will film a... My rhinoplasty experience video and give you guys all the details. Um, but I might do that when my nose has gone down a little bit more. Because it's so swollen. Anyway, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. And... Thank you guys for being so supportive about me having plastic surgery. Um, I definitely think that it's going to help with my confidence. And yeah, I feel good about it. So thank you so much for all the love. I love you guys so much. I will see you in my next video. Hello lovers, it's me, Squaw Marie Whiteley. And I thought I would just quickly film this to put into my rhinoplasty diary vlog whatever the hell you want to call that um just because my nose continues to get smaller each and every day so i kind of just wanted to show you guys what it's looking like now i think it's been like two weeks post-op um so it's a lot smaller than what it was when i got the cast taken off obviously it was huge when I got the cast taken off and apparently it will continue to shrink. So here's what it looks like from the side. I think it's shortened a little bit. But yeah, apparently it will continue to go down even more. So I just have to be patient and wait to see the results. Um, I can still feel that it's really swollen. Um, and it does take a long time to go down, obviously, because they ripped my whole face up. <laughs> cool. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what it's look like, looking like now because it does look really different to what it did the other day when I was ending the vlog. So, I will continue to keep you guys updated on that. So, yeah, um, I'll continue to show you guys what it looks like in the next upcoming months obviously because I'll be filming and you'll be able to see how much it goes down so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this vlog I hope you guys found it interesting and if you guys have any questions comment below I'd be happy to answer them for you I love you guys and thanks for watching